This is Suzanne in France, property reference number SIF 001830. It's a detached country cottage in a hamlet, not too far from Ville du Le Poil, the famous town for the copper. Straight in now to the kitchen dining room. Useful walk-in pantry storage area here. And then here you have space for the fridge. Space and plumbing for your washing machine in here as well. Kitchen units. double doors out and a window to the front so everything else is double glazed apart from that those double doors a separate lounge nice and snug and you've got it nice and light again so you've got the glazed double doors out to the garden then go through to a room which has been used as a workshop and storage I've put this down on details as a study because it seems a little bit of a waste of a room as it is. And there is some outside storage as well. So that's a room to finish. Then upstairs. So this is the first floor from that end study. So they've got it arranged as a games room. Now apparently that leakage has been stopped the problem has been fixed on the roof but it hasn't been redecorated since so this room as you can see being used as a games room double aspect and then here you have the first of the bedrooms so a nice separation the other bedrooms are through the up the stairs from the kitchen this one on its own It's got a cloakroom, so it's got a toilet and hand basin up here. Storage area there. Could probably be organised to take a shower. And then you have a walk-in wardrobe as well here. So we're now back down the stairs and going through the lounge. Back through the kitchen. And then upstairs. So on this side, you've got first of three bedrooms. So we've called them bedrooms. They are all under nine metres squared because we have to measure from one metre 80. So although you can see they're being used as bedrooms and we've called them bedrooms, technically they're not big enough to be bedrooms. And a third one there. Then you have a bathroom on this side as well with a bath, toilet and hand basin. The roof will need looking at. It's part slate to the front, sorry, to the back and part corrugated iron and then slate at the front as well. This is looking back at the house from the garden. So it wraps around as well on a lower level, but this is the area that's used as garden with the lawn. Nice concrete patio area with barbecue. 
It's a neighbouring property there on the right. Through here, you've got another bit of garden, just to the fence that you see there. And to the top of those steps there, that's not a right of way. And there was a tool shed there on the right hand side. Tool shed or workshop. They have a tree come down whilst they weren't there, so that's just being cut up. But there is parking for two or three cars on the lower level. If you'd like any more information about this property, please head across the website suzanneinfrance.com. Thank you.